PFAS contamination continues to plague drinking water around the state, prompting a new federal proposal from Senator Tammy Baldwin. News 19's Bowen Kedrovich spoke with the senator and French Island residents dealing with the dangers of these forever chemicals. Town of Campbell residents share their struggles managing daily tasks, being unable to use their faucet water for simple routines. I have to have a gallon jug sitting by my sink just to rinse my vegetables and fruits. I keep it by my sink so I don't you know, turn on my faucet, this is just as a reminder. One of the big things was our garden. Because we have a watering system in our yard to keep our, you know, our yard nice and it would affect our garden. So we put our garden under and, and we got rid of that. Senator Tammy Baldwin, who sat in on Friday's roundtable discussion, recently introduced the Healthy H2O Act. After helping secure $3.7 million in grant money for the City of La Crosse to pursue water purifying technology. It's a huge disruption to life to learn that your water, your drinking water is contaminated. We have it, we've, we've tackled those issues on interim basis before. I think it's really important for communities to have a short-term emergency plan, um, a sort of mid-term plan, and then obviously a long-term vision to clean the water up so it's no longer a worry. Senator Baldwin recognizes the frustration of not having an immediate fix to the situation. As for what Teresa Kazarik thinks, it is time for action. It's not going to be solved quickly. We know this is going to take quite a while and unfortunately we're going to have to live with it. But we hope that they would start working on it because it will take a long time to, to get it fixed. In the meantime, Teresa will continue to use bottled water until her faucet water is free from harmful chemicals. Now, the EPA notes that per and polyfluoroalkyl substances can increase certain health risks if ingested at high levels over time. And a note, boiling water does not remove PFAS contamination.